and hello everyone. This is Elliot Serrano for the Chicago Red Eye and geek to me coming to you from the San Diego Comic Convention here at the Strange Kiss booth where I'm with um, toy designer and artist Nathan Hamill. Hey Nathan. Hey, how are you doing? How you doing? Good. Having a good show? Very good, yeah. Good. Yeah. Uh, we're here uh, because Nathan is... And I don't know why. I feel like I know you from somewhere. Bye. Where? No, eh, forget it. But anyway, so uh, Nathan, I've become a big fan of yours because you do some really cool toys. Thank you. Particularly a, a character that I've grown very fond of, uh, Boris the Raccoon. Boris the Raccoon, yes. Well, uh, tell us about Boris. Uh, Boris is uh, uh, something I started, uh, the character I started drawing a few years ago. Um, last year we released it through a company called U1 Toy Arts. Um, he's uh, right here. It's a uh, two and a half inch uh, Rotocast vinyl figure. And um, it's a uh, surly little little fellow. I was going to say, he, he looks kind of surly. I yeah. mean, you look at him. Now, I, I know when um, when I got my Boris in the mail and I put him on my desk at work, he immediately took over. <laughs> I mean, he, he, he didn't like the the mead drinking uh, 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 beaver from the Narnia. Right. right. And uh, Snoopy got just pushed to the back. Right. So, you know, if you check out my Twitter, my TwitPick account, you'll see the photo. Uh, but what, what was the inspiration for Boris? Um, Joe Pesci. It's sort of... <laughs> Really? He's got a little, you know, a little, little, little Joe Pesci in him. I don't know. Um, you know, it's a little Napoleon complex, Napoleon I guess it would complex. be, yeah. So, yeah. like, is it possible that one day Boris is saying, hey, what, am I funny? <laughs> I'm here to make you laugh? I'm here to amuse you? What, am I a clown? Like a clown. You know, yeah. I'm looking at it. Yeah, that's what his face is telling me. Are you a uh, raccoon fan? Uh, yeah, I, uh, I grew up around them uh, in uh, Malibu. So, uh, we are sort of, uh, it was... Suburbs, but on a sort of on a hill. So there was a there, there's wildlife there. We um, so I you know was around raccoons, a lot of raccoons, deer, um, bobcats, coyotes, a lot of coyotes. But raccoons. So I've sort of had an affinity for them. You grew up in Malibu. Yeah, yeah. Why do I feel like I know you from somewhere? <laughs> uh, I was on the hills. Oh, ah, yeah. there you go. Yeah. Okay, the hills. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so anyway. Boris is um, is a toy being sold here at the Strange Kiss booth. Yes. Um, uh, what, what? Distributed through D, uh, DKE also. Uh -huh. um, and uh, yeah, U1 Toy Arts is the uh, is the company that uh, released it. How long um, have you been des designing toys? Uh, a year and a week. Wow. And what made you think? Yeah, I want to design uh, toy raccoons. Uh, I don't know. It's the first thing first thing that came to mind. The uh, second second figure was uh, a little. I had, a, I had a few to pick from, but this was naturally the, uh, the first one that I, I thought of. Now, when you look at Boris, Bo Boris looks like he's a little bit peeved. Right. Now, <laughs> this little guy here just looks sad. I mean, I feel I feel like I want to cuddle this guy. I, I, see, I don't know. I, I wouldn't... I would say bashful or bashful. unsure, uncertain, but... Um, I don't, maybe not happy, but I don't. I wouldn't necessarily say say sad. Okay. But you 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 know it's it's your interpretation. <laughs> let you. Yeah yeah no he he I meant I was going for sad. <laughs> we'll go with that. All right. Uh, do you have anything going on uh, besides the, the toy figures? I know you've got some Boris T-shirts. Yes. Um, got mine right here. Yeah. Styling with the Boris T-shirt. Nicely um, designed. Um, you, you're hoping that Boris becomes like the next Mickey Mouse. You'll have a lot of, like you'll have a whole, uh, like it'll be Hamill Land, and then people will like go ride the Boris cups, and you know. I'm they, pretty sure that's definitely gonna. Yeah, I, mean, you know, I think that's gonna happen. People will spin in circles, and then if they foam at the mouth, it means they've got rabies from <laughs> from Boris, or you know. I'm 98 percent sure there will be a theme park. Awesome! So, yeah. Awesome! I'm there. Yes. I'm there. Nine, 97. Let's 97. go with 97. I swear I know you from somewhere. <laughs> Did, have you done any, like, have you ever been in a movie? No, no. No? No. I was an extra, but... It, oh. Yeah. Uh, Clueless. You were in Clueless, weren't you? I was Breck and Meyer, I think. Oh. Okay. Anything or, else you want to share? <laughs> um, oh, and this, this one here is... Um, 
this is this is a uh, resin piece that was hand painted, um, one of eight. So this is was de this debuted this morning. What is it the twenty? Is it the twenty third? Yeah. Friday the twenty third. Um, but there'll be more more colorways uh, for Designer Con, which is uh, in Pasadena, November. I think mid to late November. That'll be the next uh, show that I will uh, be at. Now you sculpt these yourself. Or do no, you, you draw uh, the you draw them, design I them, and design them. Uh, these were both uh, Boris and uh, Boris were both sculpted by David Kawano. It was a really really great uh, sculptor. Do you do like a, a three hundred and sixty degree view? I'll of do it? the turnarounds, which I submit to to, uh, to David. He will do a pass. We kind of go back and cool. forth and refine uh, refine it. So beyond the theme park. Right. You know, the Hamiland theme park, what else do you hope to get? Project A2, 2036, yes. <laughs> um, oh, I'm sorry, what was it? What, what, would, what do you hope to see, you know, come of this, you know? Um, I just, I, you know, I've been a, a fan of, of, of toys since I was a wee lad, and, uh, you know, just I am want to keep on, continue to create them, so that's the goal. Okay, so I've asked you this before on Twitter, you've said no. All right, okay. what was this? Come on, dude, you want, you want to go fishing? No, no. Come on. I, I, that's fishing. I don't know you that I've well. I've got, <laughs> I've got matching vests. Or have you seen the talented Mr. Ripley? Yeah. Okay. I, I will be, I will, I will be single white female. <laughs> I will become you. I move to Chicago. <laughs> that's a good one. That's a good one. Okay. All right. Well, on that note. Wow. On that note. On that note. The bloody oar. <laughs> <laughs> this has been. Uh, Elliot Serrano with Nathan Hamill from San Diego. This has been Geek to Me.